Hey guys, it's me Dafida. Welcome to the Simple Fantasy. As you guys know, this is number four of Taiwan Day Challenge. So today I'm gonna tell a story. Okay, let's get started. Most of the time, there was a girl named Zoe who was in a bad situation. He told his brother Ted, but he could not also solve the problem. Then his grandmother came. Then he, Zoe told his grandmother that when she was going to school, then she forgot the pen. Then when she go to the class, then she could not find the pen and complain to the teacher. Then the teacher gave the whole class to one day to convey the problem. But when Ted and when Zoe came to home, then he saw the pen that was in the table. She forgot to put it in a bag. Then if she if she don't tell the teacher that um, that it's my pen, I got it, then the teacher will punish her. But if she don't, then the whole class will be punished. Then, uh, then Zoe tell this to her grandmother. The grandmother said, hmm, it's a bad situation. You should handle by yourself. But I can help you by our story. Then Zoe said, okay. Once upon a time, there was a monkey king who were many monkeys. They lived in a mango tree. People never eat the mango. So they were very curious that if one mango fell on the river, the people will eat and will that there will be dangers, dangers for them. Then one day, the a mango fell on the river. Then the monkey king saw it. Then the creep and all monkeys were screaming loudly. Then the monkey said, we should not be panicked. We, I think that we smell a danger soon. So when a fisherman got the mango and showed to the king, the king was very curious. So he told his all minister about it. Then the king, then the king set off to the jungle to see what kind of fruit it is. This one of the ministers said that this is a rare mango who is very tasty and delicious that could be found on the deep forest. Then the king set off with them. Then they saw the mango tree, but they were, uh, then the monkeys were screaming loudly. Then the monkey king said, that, please don't panic, let's get a plan. By the plan, the first, the monkey king tied with the creeper and went to the nearby tree to be safe. Then all the uh, monkeys were um, with the creeper, they were climbing and going to that tree. But there was a wicked monkey who didn't like the king. So when they crossed the river, then he, then he jumped on the floor mighty and kicked the monkey. The keeper fell and also the monkey fell. Then he, then he was, his head broke by a stone. Then the king saw it. The king went to the monkey king. And uh, the monkey king refused to come with him. Then monkey king said that I'm happy because all of my sub subjects are happy. By saying this, the monkey king died. So the king felt pity on him. So after hearing this story, Zoe said that um, I will tell the teacher if I get punished or not. I will tell the teacher. So I hope you like the video. So subscribe to this channel. Bye.